Hey everybody, welcome back to Big Red EDC. New month, new Jack Wolf knife. Oh my goodness. Yes, indeed. This one, oh, is going to be a good one. What do we got? The Feel Good Jack in Fat Carbon Lava Flow. Oh, yes. Yes, yes, yes. We do like us some Lava Flow Fat Carbon. All right. Feel Good Jack. Now, Ben always sends, you know, a little video out kind of talking about his inspiration for the knives and just kind of giving us the lowdown. And I'm, I, I really, really have to keep from calling this the Dr. Feel Good Jack because he used that analogy, you know, feel good, Dr. Feel Good, the 80s. We know, we know Ben likes his 80s. I do as well. Um, kind of stuck there at times. But anyway, uh, I really have to keep myself from calling this the Dr. Feelgood Jack because that is, that's a perfect, perfect analogy. Very good because when we get it open, you'll see why, but let's see what it all comes with. As always, we have the awesome hog artwork. Yes, same artwork is on the can. Very good. Of course, we have a slip that comes with every single knife. We have a knife. Oh, we got gray this time. I haven't had a gray one before. I'm not sure he's done gray. Let's see. What do we have here? Nice. Just what the doctor ordered. Very cool. The artwork is fantastic. Uh, Sean Tiffany does an amazing job on that. Uh, very, very cool. But as always, you get the whole package. You know, oh, we got a gray one and a big one. All right. I I'm excited for this one. I really kind of am. Uh, it's well, it's red lava flow. So, whoo, my goodness, would you look at that? That is very, very nice. It's coming through a little bit more orange on the camera, but it's pretty, it seems pretty red here in the light. We'll get it out in the natural light and see. My goodness, that looks cool. And as you can tell, uh, the whole Dr. Feel Good analogy, because this is patterned after the doctor's knife, for sure. I'm sure you guys have been seeing it all over. Everybody's posting pictures, Ben posting pictures, but it is. It's patterned after that doctor's knife style knife. Now, as you see, it is a single bladed, which, you know, your traditional doctor's knives have an actual blade and then the spatula, I guess you could say, the second implement on it. But no, this is a single-bladed jack. Very, very nice. Sexy, sexy long pull. I mean, these knives are just so, so well done. And my goodness, look at that. Say it again. I'm telling you, they are probably the best, best manufactured slip joints on the market right now. Sorry, uh, sorry, GEC fans. Ooh, that's got a... That's got a good pull. Wow, that might be the stiffest pull I've had on one yet. Wow, that's that's got to be a seven. I mean, trust me, guys, I'm not an expert when it comes to pull strength and all that. But from what I've learned and trying, that's got to be close to a seven. Oh, my goodness. Look at that nice sheep's foot blade on it. S90V again, guys, as you can see. Right there, S90V, nice choil cut in it. Oh my goodness. That back spring is solid. Holy cow. I'm putting quite a bit of pressure on that knife and it's not going anywhere. Jumps into the half stop. Man, that is pretty pretty sexy goodness gracious all right and i told <laughs> i immediately messaged ben you know after he sent us that video and stuff and i was like oh yeah i'm gonna like this one you used a motley crew reference so yeah i'm good <laughs> sorry it's true you know like i said stuck in the 80s so what are we looking at overall one two three four five six you're looking at about six and three quarter on this, about three and three quarters on the handle, then you should have 
just about right at a three inch blade, maybe a hair over. And then your cutting edge is actually going to be about two and three quarters on this one. Very, very nice. And of course, I didn't pull out any of the other Jack Wolf knives to take to compare it to. But here we go. I got one here real quick. Let's try the low drag. Now, it's a nice, slender, thin handle, thin blade. I like that. I like it a lot. This is going to be a fun one to carry. There you go. There it is up against the low drag. Probably, st still probably my favorite. I got to say that. Still probably my favorite. I just love the overall look, the teardrop, the big pronounced drop point blade. Love it. So I'll give you a, a comparison against a PM2 real quick. Obviously, it's going to be a smaller knife than the PM2. Come back a little. There you go. But there you go. There it is up against the PM2. And the bug out. Oh, I got a good one. I've got a good comparison here. There we go. Let's do this one. How about... This nice Northfield GEC number 49. Similar. Similar style. Not quite, but ish. So there you go. That's oh, a little bit bigger than the 49. Uh, this is probably one of my favorite GECs right here. I love, love that handle. Very cool. But there you go. There it is up against the GEC number 49. I know Ben, big time fan of the GECs, well, slip joints, period, really. I, I, I've i seen part of his collection. He's got a fantastic, fantastic collection. So, but man, overall, yeah, this is going to be a sexy, sexy knife. Obviously, it's got the slip. That's how I carry it. Definitely going to slip carry. Always slip carry these. So what do we got for a weight? 60 grams or 2.1 ounces. Very nice. Love the lava flow. Love the way that looks. Yes, yes, yes. Now, these guys release this coming Friday, guys. This coming Friday at uh, 11 a.m. Pacific time or 2 p.m. Eastern. That's his normal uh, kind of release times. That's when they'll be coming out. So, look, guys, get them. <laughs> get them while you can if you want them because they go quick. Now, the really interesting thing about this, I say it's interesting because, well, I think it's interesting, is this is the first model that does not have a micarta model. You've got five, five of these models, and they're all the carbon fiber. You've got, it's either fat carbon or the camel carbon. Of course, You've got the Fat Carbon Lava Flow right here. You got Fat Carbon White Storm. That one looks pretty sexy. You got a Cam Camo Carbon Limoncello, which is a yellowish. Very cool. You've got the Fat Carbon Dark Matter Blue, which is always good. And then you have a Camo Carbon Bazooka Pink. And from the pictures, that one looks pretty awesome. Now, all, all the models, since they are carbon, carbon fiber, are going to be the same price, the $299.99. So... Your favorite retailers are going to have them. You know, Ben has done a fantastic job marketing these and just pulling them all together like he always does. So go to your favorite retailer. Check them out. Hey, if you go to, uh, let's see, I think Blue Creek is going to carry them again. Uh, Traditional Pocket Knives, SMKW, um, all those places. I do have affiliate links. Always, always welcome. Uh, you guys helping out the channel, if you will. No worries if you don't. Just get yourself an amazing, amazing knife. That's that's all you need to do. But hey, if you want to help out Big Red in the in the process, always appreciate it, guys. Ben, thank you so much again for putting out just another uh, tremendously amazing knife. Very, very cool. I love it. I love it. Thank you guys for stopping by. And checking out the Feel Good Jack, not the Dr. Feel Good Jack, the Feel Good Jack from Jack Wolf Knives. Remember, this Friday the 12th, 11 a.m. Pacific, 2 p.m. Eastern is when they released. Uh, if you 
If you have one, you know you really, really want, get them when they drop, guys, because they do go quick. I, I just, wow. Anyway, thanks a lot, guys. Always appreciate you. Thank you, Ben. Like, subscribe, leave me that comment. You know I love talking to you. Until next time, I'll talk to you later, guys. Bye-bye.